Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today's recipe is going to be an easy chicken corn soup. For this recipe, you will need one pound of boneless chicken. You will also need half a cup of corn, which I've crushed up here, and two tablespoons of butter. I'm also making a sauce to be served with the soup. It has two green chilies, sriracha sauce, and vinegar. We're going to mix all these ingredients together. I'm going to add three tablespoons of vinegar. One tablespoon of sriracha sauce. You can also use any type of hot sauce. And we're going to mix this together and set aside. I'm also going to put vinegar in the green chilies and let them soak. To start off, I'm going to add butter to a hot pan and we're going to add in our chicken. When the chicken has changed its color and it's cooked, we're going to remove it on a plate. While the chicken is hot, I'm going to take a fork and shred up the chicken. Once the chicken is shredded, we're going to add it back to the pan we were cooking it in. I will also be adding some water, about 4 to 6 cups. Now we will add the crushed corn. half a spoon of salt. Make sure to mix everything and we're going to allow this to cook. While the chicken is cooking, we're going to grab the rest of our ingredients for the soup. I'm going to be adding three tablespoons of cornstarch to half a cup of water. We're going to use this mixture to thicken up the soup. I'm also going to be taking egg whites of two eggs.
make sure to whisk the eggs. While the soup is cooking, I'm going to add 2 tablespoons of Chinese salt, also known as MSG, and half a tablespoon of black pepper. You can also use this according to your taste. Now I'm going to add the corn flour mixture that we made. We can add in the egg whites now and continue to mix. You can see now the soup is much thicker than before and it is ready to serve. This soup recipe is very simple and easy. I really hope you give it a try at home and let me know how it was in the comments below. I'm now going to add the dressing that we made earlier. You can do this according to your taste of how spicy you want the soup to be. I've used very simple ingredients for this soup recipe. This is probably something that everyone has on hand. I've made this recipe without soy sauce, but if you guys enjoy it, you can also add it in. And here you have it, a very simple and easy soup recipe. Make sure you give it a try and share with your friends and family. Thank you for watching my videos and supporting my channel. And as always, I'll see you in my next one.